Years ago in the early 1800s um, is where the brewery was established. It was a small, uh, very small brewery on the shores of the Thames. It's um, convenient to have it near the water source. Water is very important to making a beer. Um, and so John Labatt, he uh, was a farmer in the area and he had uh, purchased the brewery from the previous owners and started brewing beer there. It was just a, a natural place to have uh, his business there and like I said water is a finite resource and something that you need to make beer so it was a perfect location. Um, because we are situated right there on the banks of the Thames and we have that historical connection, um, the, the personnel and the employees and the people in the area um, have taken ownership of the brewery and it wasn't that long ago that we actually adopted that section behind the brewery um, as our section of the Thames. And since we did that, um, we've had cleanup activities. We've participated in the Thames River cleanup for 14 years now. So there's a lot of passion there. There's, uh, you know, we really care for the community. We care for the people that live there because we have to, you know, cohabitate together. So we have to have our business as well as get along with our neighbors and protect the natural resources. So it's something that's really important to us. Our employees have a lot of pride. Back to River will help people understand how much the river means to us, what other people have done to improve it and what how they can get involved. Um, it's a way to celebrate the fact that we are fortunate enough to have a freshwater resource so close to us that we can enjoy. Um, it's aesthetically pleasing. Um, it has a lot of value. Water is a finite resource. We're not making any more of it. You can't make any more of it, so we have to protect what we have.